I would like to show you in this video how to update the zoom program for doing this we will see if our program is update or not how can we see that our program is up to date please click at the corner of the settings uh, place and you will see that check for updates when you click check for updates program will check and if your program is up to date then you will see this message you are up to date but if there is if your program is previous version then you can have a chance to date it from this place so now our program is up to date so i will try to show you the new features in this version so let's have a look at the new features in this new updated version in this new version you can have a chance to share more than one screen at one time before you can just share one screen at a time but then in the new version you can have a chance to share one two three four screens at one time so how can we do this you can do this with just clicking the screen holding control button first of all you you hold the control button and then you will just click the screens that you want to share you see that i can i can select four different screen and then i can share them and i can share them at the same time the second important update is on a security section when you click the security you will see a new uh, link here suspend participant activities if you notice any suspicious activities or suspicious participants in your uh, meeting then you can immediately when you click the suspend participant activity you will see a message like this suspend all participant activities and what will happen uh, at this moment when you click the suspend everyone's video and audio will be turned off screen sharing will be stopped and the meeting will be locked and so you can also have a chance to report this to zoom so this part is also important if you have a suspicious activities in your meeting then you can immediately close your meeting with clicking the suspend participant activities link here and the last feature is on the background and filters part uh, you can reach to that place by clicking the settings and then you will click the background and filters part and when you click this place you will see at the right bottom studio effects beta this is also a very uh, cool feature that you can put a lot of things uh, on your face and on your lips you can put eyebrows like this you can select one of them and when you select them and then you can also have a chance to change its opacity here like here and also you can change its color when you click here then you can change also the color it, it is the same for mustache and beard like this then it's a really this is really cool for male teachers especially and also you can have a chance to put the lip color to your lips then you can also have a chance to select the lips color please and also you can uh, have a chance to change its opacity from this place so these are three new features in zoom 546 uh, version and i hope that it will be useful video for you to understand the new features in the new version i hope that these features will be useful in your lessons and thanks for watching my video mm -hmm.